Now to this story in the Western Cape, a troubling mass shooting. The motive behind the latest killings in Mitchell's Plain is at this point unknown. Now two boys were gunned down while four were wounded in Beacon Valley on Thursday night. Ian Sears, Ronald Masinda spent the day at the site and he has the story. Amin Sinclair is cleaning the blood of the victims gunned down near his house. He says the boys who were shot were part of his football team and weren't involved in gangs. We as uh, uh, coaches and sports people, we tried, tried our best, you know, to get this, uh, the children from the streets. And um, then people, the gangsters come, you know, and then uh, um, they just come here and shoot the children. The motive behind the shooting here in Beacon Valley is unknown, but community members here say the attackers went on a shooting spree. The victims are aged between 14 and 18. Community members say drive-by shootings occur often in Beacon Valley. It's not the first time. It always happens as Rakstow for now. Then later, for Kregen, it has their drive-by. And so, so it's just not hard to see them and think that it was innocent. One community member says sometimes teenagers here get killed for refusing to join gangs. They do the same thing with my child. He's run away. He's, he's so innocent. He just don't want to join the gang. So he was fighting with one of the gang members. The night they come, we have a third. 21st year, only one of my mm. the friends, his friends come out to pee. They say, what are you doing on my ground? It's the other ground. Police say no arrests have been made and that a 72-hour activation plan is in place to find the perpetrators. Ronald Masinda, Cape Town.